So a as we've seen, we want to design our section to be tension controlled um, so that we can take advantage of a higher phi factor um, because of our increased ductility uh, when we have a, t a tension controlled section. Um, so if we're looking at a, a similar section as to what we've looked at before, just rectangular section with uh, just tension reinforcement of area a AS, and if we have our compression block with a depth of C, and distance from the centroid of our uh, compression block down to the uh, steel is D minus C. So then once again we'll have our strain diagram about the centroid of, or about the neutral axis, or with zero strain at the neutral axis. We'll have 0 0.003 um, strain in the top, and we'll have uh, steel strain in the bottom. Uh, so if we want to design our section to be tension controlled, then we need our steel strain to be greater than 0 0.005. So that's what we're going to find in this uh, video is the amount of um, our steel area so that we'll have a uh, strain in the bottom uh, or in the, in the steel of 0 0.005. Um, so first we can uh, set our, um, we have these two similar triangles. Uh, so we'll say our EC over C is equal to ES over D minus C. So if we plug in our strain and our tension controlled strain, uh, we'll get this expression here. Um, so we can solve this expression for C and we'll find that C will equal D times 0 0.003 over 0 0.003 plus 0 0.005. Um, so this is just going to equal 3 eighths D. All right, so then what, what we can do is uh, we can plug this in and um, solve for our equilibrium. Um, so if we have our, uh, for equilibrium, we'll have our AS tension controlled times FY is going to be equal to 0 0.85 F prime C times B times beta 1 C. Um, so we can plug in and find that our AS tension controlled uh, will be equal to 0 0.85 F prime C B beta 1 C and all this times uh, 1 over Fy. Um, so if we plug in our C value then we'll get our AS tension controlled equal to um, I guess 3 eighths times 0 0.85 B times D times beta 1 times F prime C over FY. So if we design our steel to be less than this value, then we'll have a tension controlled section. So um, if our AS is less than or equal to AS 
tension controlled, then our section will be tension controlled. So we'll say uh, then tension controlled is okay. So we always want to uh, keep our area of steel uh, less than our tension controlled limit. 